from all this warm weather and all of a sudden all this rain all of a sudden and then flash flood warnings, I think it's kind of insane. I've been over here on the west side for 30 years. I have never, ever seen it like this before, so it's pretty amazing. For residents on the west side of Colorado Springs and other flood zone areas, the threat of our recent raging waterways is all too real and should not be taken lightly. It's hypnotic and it, it feels like it's going to pull you into the water. And I think that the issue is people go out and they want to look at it like I'm doing. And you might think you could stand on the edge and be safe, but you know, you slip and you're gone. So when it comes to flash flood conditions like Southern Colorado is experiencing, as well as other parts of our state, Authorities continue urging the public to remember a few tips that could be a big difference in your safety. And I can't underscore the danger of the water, even when it may not look that dangerous, how absolutely dangerous that moving water is. Fire officials warn to be extra cautious, especially at night. Don't try to outrun moving water and get to higher ground as soon as possible. And don't drive through floodwaters. But if caught, stay in your vehicle, remain calm, and call 911. Our firefighters um, have world-class training on rescue operations, and we want to ensure that, that if something does happen, that our, our rescue specialists can handle that. And it's not just the running water through culverts, creeks, and rivers causing concern. Standing water on side streets and highways can put drivers in serious danger. If your car starts to hydroplane or if you hit that big body of water, the biggest thing you want to do is look where you want to go and keep steering that way. Otherwise, the big thing about hydroplaning is speed is what causes hydroplaning. Literally, the faster you go, um, the tires ride kind of up on top of the water because it can't displace the water in enough time. So especially when we have really wet, rainy roads, we need to bring the speeds down to allow our tires to clear that water um, from, from the trip. In Colorado Springs, Craig Coffey, Fox 21 News.